As Team Uganda athletes continue to leave the country for the Olympic Games in Paris, France, the community in Sebe region remain in a prayerful mood, hoping to receive their sons and daughters back home with medals. And even as we come here, flag off our athletes to go for the, 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 the Olympic Games. May you be with us. And every celebration we shall have here, the whole spirit shall die. 17 out of Uganda's 21 athletes for this year's Olympic Games are all from the Sebei region. The team pitched camp at Trinity Biblical Institute in Captura, where they have been undergoing training for the last one and a half months. John Sadi Sechizivu, also known as Cherob, the deputy principal of Trinity Biblical Institute, says as part of the community, they have no choice but to support the athletes for the benefits that come with their good performance. As a community, we support them because we get the pride when they win the medals. But at the same time, when they win, the presents they get and the monies they have invested in the region. Uh, take an example of uh, the captain Joshua Cheptegei. Uh, he has constructed schools, he has foundations uh, which are creating jobs directly and indirectly. So the community is always supporting these people because they know that there is a direct benefit and indirect benefit. He says hosting the team at their campus is also a blessing in disguise. We discovered that actually these athletes are also religious and the coaches because some of them are pastors, like a pastor coach Peter Cherangat, uh, Pastor Victor Kiplangat, uh, but also Njia, Benjamin Njia is an elder in the church. Uh, Perus, all, actually all of them are active in the church. Now, uh, their stay here was conforming to our vision and what we are looking at. So they help us to preach the gospel through games and sports. Sari also says camping at the religious site has helped to turn around the athletes psychologically. At first, we used to have some athletes who used to believe that maybe winning uh, would come through uh, some magical uh, kind of practices, maybe going through a cave, going through visiting a diviner. But now uh, we have discovered that, okay, uh, these people, when they come here, uh, to worship with us and then uh, believe in God because partly also we are looking at evangelizing the gospel. So we said no, the only way is actually through God. Uganda will be hoping to bring back the biggest number of medals from the Olympic Games given the record number of participants at this year's Games. Sam Poza, NTV Sport.